Hey guys, welcome back again to another Tech Guru video. Today we are in Adobe Photoshop and I will be showing you how to download and install new brushes to use within Photoshop for your projects. Now this is a very, very easy process if you follow along step by step. And as always, if you have any questions, put them in the comment box below. So let's go ahead and get started. So Obviously, when you go into Photoshop and you click on the brush tool here, uh, up here you have all different types of brushes that you can use and you can change the size of these brushes, the thickness, the stroke, whatever it may be. Well, what you may not have known is that you can actually load new brushes within to Photoshop and this is a great tool to use when people are out there who are designers that are designing these new brushes and they're a great tool and asset to use as someone who works in Photoshop or Illustrator. So let's go ahead now and let's go ahead and I want to show you how to download these brushes. So the first thing you want to do is open up your web browser and there are many ways of going about downloading brushes for Photoshop. I prefer this website that a buddy of mine uh, set me on to. It's called brusheasy.com, B-R-U-S-H-E-E-Z-Y.com. When you go there, you not only can download free brushes, but you can get patterns and textures as well. But we're going to stick with brushes. Let's go ahead and click on the brushes tab right up here. And you can sort them by the version of Photoshop you have. You can also sort them by the newest and most popular first, and then just click on the filter button. I'm going to go ahead and click on this jar of heart brush set here. I'm going to go ahead and show you how to download and install. Now the first thing you want to notice here is this version is for CS5. Now if you have CS4 you can just go up there and click on the CS4 section and you can download brushes for that as well. And what you want to do is you can actually preview these brushes. Uh, just click on the preview button and it shows you here the different brushes you will be receiving. And you want to click on the big blue download file button here. Now I'm going to show you how to do this on both a Windows and a Mac. Uh, I'm not going to show you how to do it on a Windows. I'm just going to tell you okay, as we walk through the step by step process. First thing you want to do is click download file. Now once you've downloaded the file onto your computer, however you access your downloaded files locate that file so if you're on a Mac go to show and finder if you're on a Windows go to downloads whatever it may be and then once you are there you want to shrink that and you want to go ahead and unzip that brush pack so right here the brush pack that I just downloaded I want to double click on it and unzip that file once I have done that okay you will see up here a new brushes logo has come up here. This is the jar of hearts dot ABR. Now you notice the dot ABR that means it's an Adobe brush okay that is the file extension that you want to make sure you have. So what we want to do is we then want to make sure we install this into our Photoshop. So if you're on a Mac go to your finder if you are on a Windows go to your my computer section of your computer so go to my computer and the next step you want to take on a Mac will be go over to your applications panel here if you're in a Windows go to program files okay after you're in your my computer once you're there you want to locate your Adobe Photoshop CS5 folder now if you're on Windows it will be within your Adobe folder okay so click on your Adobe Photoshop CS5 folder once you are in this folder it doesn't matter if you're on a Windows or a Mac you can click on the presets folder once you are in presets you will then see a folder titled brushes double click on that folder this is where all of your brushes are stored within Photoshop. So what you want to do now is locate that brush pack that you just downloaded off BrushEasy.com, click and hold and drag that into your brushes folder. Now once your brush is already drug into the brushes folder, what you then want to do for just to make sure that it gets in there is you actually want to locate that brush pack that you just downloaded off of the brusheasy.com website and you want to double click on that brush pack okay so just double click on that brush that you have just downloaded and then what you want to do is you want to then open up Photoshop and you can then go to your brush panel right here so go to your brush right here on your toolbar go up to the top left hand corner where it shows you all of the different styles of brushes you have and down here at the bottom you see 
now we have the new jar of hearts brush pack so now you can go over here and treat this as if it is a normal brush so I can go up here and I can actually change the color I can change all the different stuff that I normally would within Photoshop so if I want to change this color to a pink color I can then go up here and I can do it just like that okay so now I have all of these brushes that I downloaded right off of brusheasy.com. Now guys, this is a very simple and easy process. If you have any questions, put them in the comment box below. I will answer every one that is down there. And guys, as always, don't forget to rate, comment, like, and subscribe. It does help me out. And I will see you guys next time.